the narcissist has to pull you into their world. For the narcissist to affect you, for the narcissist to move you emotionally and make you experience a feeling or emotion, they have to pull you into their world. They have to bring you into their sphere of activity. This then gives them the, the ability to dominate and control you. It gives them the ability to have power and influence over you. When you enter their world, you are giving them your power. You are giving them the ability to do something or act in a particular way. You are giving them the ability to direct and influence your behavior and the course of events. You are giving them authority over you. The narcissist pulls you into their world by taking control over you. Making you their property, their possession. To do this, they have to reinterpret or redefine you. They have to mold you into what they want you to be and view you in the way that they would like or in the way that best suits them. They have to explain the meaning of certain information or actions. They have to develop an understanding of your actions, mood or way of behaving as having a particular meaning. They have to perform a sudden striking, exciting or impressive role in a way that conveys their understanding of your ideas. This is all intended to create an effect. It is intended to create a change. It is intended to cause something to happen. It is intended to create an impression within your mind. It is intended to create an idea, feeling or opinion about someone or something. An idea, feeling or opinion which is formed without conscious thought or on the basis of little evidence. And the narcissist then dictates the meaning of the information or actions. This is how they pull you into their world. Everything the narcissist does from the moment they meet you, whether it is positive or negative, is intended to produce an effect on you. It is intended to entertain impact or influence you. When they first meet you, they bring you into their world through the use of deception. They display a deceptive appearance or impression as though their world will provide you with amusement or enjoyment. They deliberately cause you to believe something that is not true for their personal gain. But then you soon discover that's not what their world is really about. It's really about locking you in and controlling you so that they can then use you to fulfill their own needs. They never had anything of significance or value to offer you. It was all an illusion. It was nothing more than a deceptive appearance or impression. They pulled you into their world. They brought you into their sphere of activity. Where you then experienced a wrong or misinterpreted perception of a sensory experience. That's all it was. None of it was real. 
to move on and recover from this, you need to leave the narcissist world. You need to go back into your own world, your own sphere of activity. You need to self-reflect and go within. Give attention and consideration to your own ideas and feelings. Define yourself. Live from the inside out rather than the outside in. Remain within yourself, within your own world, your own sphere of activity and don't let anyone pull you out of it. That is when you begin to regain your strength and focus. That is when you stop giving your power away. You stop giving people the ability to affect you. You stop giving people the ability to influence your behavior or the course of events. You remain within your own frame or structure where you can then maintain influence or authority over yourself. You can remain calm and reasonable despite provocation. When you remain within your own world, your own sphere of activity, your own frame or structure, you then develop the ability to have more control over your thoughts and feelings, which then leads to better judgment and more efficient ways of behaving, which are going to be more beneficial or favorable to you. You begin to feel more happier. You begin to feel more positive. You let go of the anxiety and fear that comes along with being a part of the narcissist world. And you begin to live a life that is more resonant or relative to you. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at narcsforevercoaching at gmail.com Check out the new merchandise in the Narcs Forever store where you can purchase your own Narcs Forever t-shirt, tank top or mug. The link is in the video description. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.